boys and girls, it's Chef Adam here in the Raw Kitchen. I got a tasty little marinade concoction for all you guys out there. Uh, what we're looking at here is uh, the makings for a big marinated veggie mix. Now, I'm using a simple miso marinade recipe out of my book, uh, The Complete Idiot's Guide to Raw Food Detox. So we have our marinade and we have our veggies. I'm using asparagus, sweet onion, some cauliflower, and some mushrooms. You could also use uh, bell pepper, um, you could put broccoli, you could put carrots, you could put a whole bunch, anything you want to marinate. I'm gonna prepare these veggies, throw them in this tub, cover it with the marinade, put the lid on it, shake it up, and then refrigerate it and leave it overnight. So we're gonna check back with you after we finish that. And uh, yeah, Pew! we're back and I uh, prepared all the veggies. We got in here is a ton of asparagus. We put a whole onion, sweet onion, and a little container of uh, portobello mushrooms, cut those up. I put the stems in here as well, cut those up small put them at the bottom. Once they marinate, they'll, they'll soften up. I even added some orange bell pepper, and then there's some fresh parsley. So this is a massive amount. Um, I recommend, unless you're doing this for Thanksgiving dinner or feeding a ton of people, you do about half of this. So I have my marinade, which is actually just really a glorified salad dressing. Um, I'm gonna pour this on here. Now keep in mind that the, the veggies are going to sweat out the, the water inside of them. The longer it marinates, the softer and more tender it will be. What do you do when you are finished with all this? You can serve it cold, or you can set it and bring it up to room temperature. What I like to do is to transfer it to maybe a casserole dish and put it in the dehydrator and warm it up that way. I have like a, a little blend here of uh, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, and nutritional yeast, and some spices. What I like to do with this mix is then sprinkle that on top of, of this marinated vegetables uh, when I put it in the dehydrator so you get a nice crispy, crunchy top. Grab the lid, snap it on here nice and tight, make sure it's sealed, and then shake it up like this. So this is one of the easy ways I've found to eat asparagus raw. It's important to cut the, the uh, thick ends off the asparagus because they get woody and tough. Take a look, there's the mixture, all kinds of goodies in there. I'll store this in the fridge overnight and then I'll serve it tomorrow. There you have it, marinated veggies from the live food experience. Check out some of the recipes here in the Complete Idiot's Guide to Raw Food Detox or find them on my website, livefoodexperience.com. Love you. Keep it live.